guys welcome back to my channel so for today's video as you guys can see by the title we are doing something very exciting today well I hope so I'm sure you guys are all very curious as to what the title means am I getting my bird what is happening so no I'm not getting a bird today honestly I don't know when I'm gonna get my bird you guys know that's just been a journey that seems to be never-ending however today I may be getting my dream pet obviously I have very little faith in people off Craigslist but long story short I may be getting a Herman's tortoise today I know you guys are probably like what where is this coming Coming from what is going on what about your bird blah 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 honestly it's a long story and it's kind of crazy and really random but I've been presented with the opportunity to adopt a Herman's tortoise and I think I'm gonna do it I've wanted one for so long and I've always said that if I was ever given the opportunity to adopt a male Herman's tortoise that I would so I'm supposed to go meet a lady tonight and get him Obviously, I don't have his enclosure set up, so that's what we're doing today. I'm gonna go to Petco, and I'm also gonna go to Pet Supplies Plus, and I'm gonna buy all the stuff that I need. But first, we have some errands to run. If I get to go pick him up tonight, hoping that the lady doesn't bail on me, then I'm definitely gonna be filming it, and I will take you guys with me because I'm really excited. A little part of me kinda doesn't believe that it's happening because, honestly, everyone on Craigslist flakes on me or ghosts me completely, hence why I have a ghost bird currently because I cannot get anyone to actually meet me and follow through with it for some reason they all bail at the last minute I know you guys have heard this story time and time again but this lady contacted me so I'm kind of hopeful and really excited about this don't worry I have a lot of experience with turtles and tortoises this is in no way shape or form an impulse tortoise this just happens to be one of those things where this has just kind of fallen in my lap and honestly I don't want to pass up the opportunity so I'm gonna go see him tonight and I may be getting him I'm really excited I hope that everything works out obviously there's always that doubt in my mind because I've been burned so many times on Craigslist but I'm really hopeful I hope that it works out and if it works out I'm gonna be so happy to finally have my Herman's tortoise that I've wanted forever and it's a male which is like more than I could ever ask for because I really didn't want a female so yeah so we are gonna go now we are gonna go buy the mercury vapor UVB bulb that he needs I'm gonna need to get another dome light just like Koa's oh my gosh I'm gonna have a turtle and a tortoise wouldn't that be so exciting I really hope this all works out so we have to go to a couple of stores I also wanted to get a water dish for him but I think he's gonna be about the size that Koa is so I don't know if I want to get Koa's water dish because it's really really big and I don't even remember where I bought it from. He does need a water dish. He does need some substrate. So I'm gonna do a mixture of topsoil and eco-earth. I know that's really good for Mediterranean tortoises. I'm so excited. Also, I gotta get his bulb and I need to get him some cuttlefish or cuddle bone for him to keep his beak trim. We just have lots to do today. So we're gonna go to a couple different stores and I'm gonna take you guys with me. First, a couple of boring errands. I'm getting gas right now. Then I gotta go to the car wash and then I kinda wanna grab something to eat. But for you guys, it'll be really fast. We'll be at the pet store in a minute. <laughs> pick a turtle. <laughs> Sorry, I think that's the cutest thing. So I just pick one? Yes, ma'am. Two. Yep, go ahead and pick one. Thank you. Okay, so this is gonna sound really silly, but I really feel like this tortoise is meant for me. And I know that it's like totally random probably for you guys because this is kind of out of nowhere. But for me, I've wanted one for so long and I've just been waiting for so long. And you wanna know something that's weird, which I'm gonna tell you guys the whole story of like how this lady found me and where this tortoise came from and like how it kind of fell into my lap. But obviously I'll tell you guys the whole story in another video whenever I do like, you know, a meet my tortoise video so you guys can really see him and everything because obviously I don't have him yet but what's really funny to me is that the day that the lady contacted me was the first day of International Tortoise Week which is actually this week and also I just went to get a veggie sandwich at Arby's and in the windowsill they had little tortoise toys it's like what are the odds of that apparently they were having a little turtle fundraiser where you donate two dollars to feed children and you get a tortoise toy or a turtle toy I just thought that was really ironic like what are the odds I just feel like I don't know I just really feel like it's meant to be and I'm getting really excited I really hope it all works out okay so we are at pet supplies plus now we're gonna go in here and see what all they have I came here first because they match prices on Amazon so if they have everything that I need here I may not have to go to Petco I really kind of hope they have everything because all I need is the mercury vapor bulb the actual flukers dome that it goes in which 
is going to be, I think, the 10-inch one with a ceramic fixture, which is what you have to have for a Mercury Vapor UVA UVB bulb. Say that to numbs fast. Also, I need a bag of Eco Earth, which I know they'll price match. I also need some cuddle bone or cuttlefish for them to trim their beak on. And I guess some crickets for lemon. Last time I was here, they didn't have those. So if they have crickets, I definitely got to get some of those. And then I think I'm going to look at their water dishes. But other than that, that should be everything that I need. So we'll see. Hopefully they have everything and then we don't have to go to Petco. Let's go to the reptile section. All right, here we are. They do have Eagle Earth. Oh, wow. Oh my gosh, that's so cheap. What? That's like a really good deal though. Here is their water dishes they have. I think this is the one that Koa has. It's pretty deep, it's pretty big. They don't have any more hides. That's the biggest one they have. That's pretty small actually. This is the bulb that I need. So we're gonna get one of those. Okay, so they only have one bag of the $5 EcoWorth, which is such a good deal because the size up from that is $20, which is like insane, it's $15 more. So I'm asking if they have another bag of that size so that I can get two bags for $10, which would be amazing because I go through EcoWorth like you would not believe. I mean, I guess you guys would believe me, you see me use it. <laughs> also, they don't have the dome lamp that I need, which is really stinky, so I'm gonna have to go to Petco because I've gotta have that 10 inch dome light. I can't use a mini and it has to be a ceramic fixture too. So I'm gonna have to go and get that one there. But that's okay, we'll just take a little trip to Petco and get our light. Okay, so we're about to leave Pet Supplies Plus. I did get the Mercury Vapor Bulb. Unfortunately, they didn't have the dome, but I did get a bag of Eco Earth, the big bag, and it was only $5, but unfortunately, I need more than one bag. Surprisingly, Pet Supplies Plus is amazing. I don't even know how this pet store is always so good every single time I go in there, and I don't think it's because they see my camera or anything like that. I honestly kind of feel like they just are a good store because every single time I go in there, they're always so helpful, and they always want to know what animals I have and all this kind of stuff but I asked them if they had more than one bag of the eco earth and they didn't so they actually gave me a rain check apparently pet supplies plus does this thing where if they don't have the item that you need and it's on sale they give you a rain check so she gave me a rain check for three bags of eco earth at 498 which is amazing that is so inexpensive for a eight quart I think bag of eco earth so I'm pretty excited so basically I just have to hold on to this they give me a call next week whenever it comes in and I can come pick up more and I get the sale price. So now we gotta head to Petco because unfortunately they didn't have a couple items that I need but that's okay. We will go to Petco and pick that up and then we should be done and we can head home. Okay, so I just got in the car. I didn't take you guys into Petco with me because there was just so many people. I also had to run into Staples because I did have to pick up my postcards. Um, I had postcards made for my channel, so I'm going to be sending them to all of you who sent me fan mail. I really appreciate it. I will be replying to all of you very, very soon. But I have a lot going on this weekend, so it'll probably be another week before I get those out. But expect to see those soon. I did pick up the Fluker's Dome Light. I also got a bag of bedding for Moo because she does need a cage clean coming up pretty soon. But it is already 2.30. I've got to hurry up and head home because Patrick's going to be home soon and then we will be heading to go get the tortoise. I'm really excited. Hi, baby. So it's the next morning and I've already given him his breakfast. He hasn't started eating yet. I think he's contemplating it. He's just got a bowl of fresh flowers, weeds, grasses, and some calcium powder. Good morning guys. So this is actually the next morning after I got my tortoise. I'm sorry I didn't get to film like a closing last night. We got home really late because he was kind of far away. And then I put him up and I didn't want to stress him out or anything. I kind of just left him, but it's been like 12 hours later. It's the next day. So I wanted to film a outro, I guess, for this video because I didn't film anything last night, but he's doing really good. I'm gonna film more videos in the future this week and get some videos out to you guys on him probably in the next couple weeks. Just give me some time. It's gonna take me a minute to adjust and get a routine with him and also I don't want to handle him a lot or stress him out so 
give me a week and then we'll get there. I'm obviously gonna film like a meet him video where I can show you guys to him in like better daylight and up close and everything so you can see him. I'm really excited, he's really cute. Everything's going really good so far. I know it probably seemed really random to all of you guys, but it was an opportunity that I refused to pass up. It doesn't change anything with the bird or anything like that, but I'm really excited. I've always wanted one and now he's here, so I'm so happy. I gotta figure out a name for him. I don't have one yet. I have two in mind, but I can't pick. I'm struggling, but I will find a name. And then obviously whenever I film my meat video where I introduce him to you guys officially because this video was all over the place, I apologize. I wasn't really sure how this video is gonna come together, but we shall see. But I will decide on a name and let you guys know soon. Just please be patient with me. I'm gonna do my best to get all four videos out to you guys. I do have a lot of stuff I'm doing this week. Just so much is happening, but I will keep you guys filled in to the best of my ability. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope that you enjoyed it. I'm really excited. The tortoise is doing really good and I will see you guys in my next video. Be kind. Bye.